Today, you will see an end to the emergency order that has existed for roughly 14 months in Kansas City. There will be no mask. That was Mayor Quentin Lucas right there announcing the end of Kansas City's mask mandate and other measures. The mayor says the city will follow the new guidance from the CDC that people who are fully vaccinated do not need to wear masks. But that doesn't mean businesses can't still require it. KCTV 5's Greg Payne is live at City Hall where the mayor made that decision. So, Greg, this is something, of course, a lot of people have been waiting for. Kelly, it has been, but even though the emergency order is officially over, there are some things that you'll still want to be aware of before you take your mask off and throw it in the trash. Now, the order ending means the city will not require mask or social distancing, and businesses don't have to report known COVID cases to the health department, but businesses are still allowed to set their own safety rules. This announcement was made based on the CDC's most recent guidelines that would allow fully vaccinated people not to be required to wear masks. Mayor Lucas says the reason the city decided to not completely follow that guidance and eliminate the requirement for everyone was because it would be nearly impossible to enforce. What I cannot do is say that we are going to send a health inspector somewhere to uh, potentially shut down a business because some folks are unvaccinated and some people who are vaccinated are there and an unvaccinated person is maskless. Without vaccine passports, without any of these other things, there's absolutely no way for us to tell. Now, of course, us heading on into a potentially busy weekend, the mayor wanted to stress the fact that, you know, of course, there's going to be people that are going to continue to wear their masks. And there's also going to be people that are not going to be wearing their masks. And he just hopes that we all just be kind to each other and respect each other's decision on whatever that person decides to do. Reporting live here in Kansas City, I'm Greg Payne for KCTV 5 News. All right. Thanks, Greg.